Oh, what's that? Is that a hangover? That's right. it. Oh, he's hung over. Overdosed. Too much summer for him. Too much ice. Give us a giant pile of brain. It could be full of them. Uh, it's no big deal, though. Freeze bolts and shotgun. They're nothing. What once seemed unbeatable? The elevator is stopped at the top. Boom, boom, boom. Let's look for another way up. Like stairs. Right? The elevator's down, right? Stairs. I feel like yes. Or burn them and then it'll work again. Right? This is like the whole earth was. Yes, the body that was laying there. It was obvious. Cool. Let's not go in there, though. Let's yeah, go let's, through that door. let's not, because it seems like there's a save point over here. Maybe it's a trap by Ruvik, changing things up. Oh, there's going to be a room, right, that we walk into that has this music going. It could be this room. That's just full of danger. Ooh. You want to read it or should I? I want you to read it. All right. Journalist Sebastian Castellanos. May 17th, 2006. Eight months since Maya and I were married, and you, little Lily, are the result of our love. I can't wait for two months to pass so that I can finally meet you. I'm going to read the next one. We'll switch off. Okay. But I must admit that I am scared. I faced countless dangers in my job, but knowing that I'm going to be a dad is the scariest thing of all. I promise to love you and to protect you with every fiber of my being as long as I am in this world. I will enter this stage of my life the same way I do every important task, with a full heart and the desire to do the best that I can. Just know that your mother and I love you already and cannot wait to welcome you into this sometimes harsh world. This stupid person thinks that she can read when yeah. she's born. You know, yeah, he's... He's gonna have to wait like five years before she can read that, mm -hmm. most likely. And then hopefully she knows that already, that they love her. Otherwise, good cover. Right, yeah. If you treated her like this garbage, way. just know that I really did love you the whole time. <laughs> nah. <laughs> nah, forget about it, girl. I love you, otherwise I wouldn't have written that thing saying I loved you. Now go scrub, scrub my floors, <laughs> Cinderella. <laughs> Cinder wench. <laughs> Cinder wench. Is this our wife, then? Actually, she might be. I think it is. I mean, we associate her with a safe spot. Reality, right? Like, come home from our sessions. Yeah. No. She ignores us. Focuses totally on ignores. her nails. Yeah. A lot of doing her nails. It's a thing that she does a lot of. There's no baby, though. No. No, we've seen no baby yet. Did our baby die? Might be. That's so, why we're going through all of this. It's the sort of thing that leaves a deep psychological scar. That's why the music plays like the, this. Yeah, the kind of. That's actually what happened. Faintly That's actually nursery sad. rhyme. I'm kind of sad now. Yeah. I was trying to not. Yeah. Yeah. Be Ho sad about hopefully it. Hopefully, we didn't kill our kid. Hopefully. That would be even more sad. I have to turn against what our character. No elevator music. The music actually stopped. Yeah. What is that? Too big. Oh, it's just... Go punch it. Or tackle it. Yeah? Because I was thinking I could just shoot the rope. But that, you could damage it. it that, that was the point that I had in mind, yeah. <laughs> I Don't you want to damage it with your fists? Uh, I was thinking the thing in there was probably going to like try and kill me. And that I wanted to... Paranoia, Tom. Paranoia. Yeah. I thought the drugs would be helping. Okay. All right. Where's Every time you use a syringe, it's go? supposed to be helping. Uh, what's going on? Do you think Kidman okay? is okay? I don't like that they used her as bait. Almost like someone's toying with us. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, jeez. Run. Just I straight can't. up. I can't. We can't move? No. I can't Hang move. in there. Just a little further. <sighs> Gonna go ahead and just pull the trigger. If he here. was a true friend, he wouldn't. He would understand. Yep. All right. So we think we gotta punch this. Again, it's a body. It is a body. Yeah. Shoot it down. Put it out of its misery. 
It's a ro more robust rope, I guess. Something uh, we have to face later, I think. We're stuck to this walking pace. There are only two. We can take them. No, that's not... Wow, that was a really weak bomb. I'm glad we all didn't fall. It was like a paradoxically weak bomb. It blew up the bridge just fine, but like both of us were unscathed. <laughs> I think he did that intentionally. Joseph. Oh, it's all a setup. Yeah, I mean, he did run towards them. Oh, they're gonna get behind cover before I can control myself. Aren't Save them. Save them before they decapitate them. Woo! Joseph. Oh God. Oh, please save. He's our friend. We gotta get over there. He would save us. You okay? I'm fine. Okay. No need to worry. Oh, we got him. You still, you're, you have a good head on your shoulders? Oh. It's problem solving. Yeah, wow. <laughs> that actually knocked He's some sense into him. He's... He is our problem solver. He's a champ. Uh, or he's setting a trap. <laughs> oh, why are we holstering our Should've weapon on that? Huh? What? <gasps> no! What the hell? Oh, it's just a matter of time. True friend. It's better this way. I understand. Why are we stopping him? <laughs> what the fuck? Now shoot him. Now think about that and jump off that cliff. Right, yeah, there's so many easy ways to kill yourself around here. <laughs> we live in such a dangerous world. Oh look, more opportunities. Jeez, really. Okay, they're coming across the bridge that we were on before. Losers. Cover me. Wait, no, Let's go. The, the plank. Yeah, why don't we just not- Move the over? plank! Isn't there a thing that we just ran over? There we go. These people. Come on, faster, buddy. We wouldn't even have to cover them if we just moved. <laughs> yep. Oh. What? Come on, shoot him. It's basically like our partner committed suicide. He's not helping us anymore. Whoa. Oh! Oh, no. oh we're just gonna flashbang ourselves. Cover your eyes. Oh! No! Don't look into his eyes! He's gonna possess you! Oh, we're out of all ammo for that. Use the guillotine. I don't think that that's gonna happen. Uh, is this just not gonna shock anyone ever? Hurry! This way! Oh, yeah, we'll hurry. Wait, no, I was just gonna be able to pick up my shock. Oh, the again, priest though. is standing there! Nice! Nice! Atheist now. <laughs> Joseph, are you all right? I. I. Uh, that's. That's not what all right sounds like. All right doesn't sound like I. I. Keep yeah. in mind, by him saying I, he still acknowledges that he is a being and is sane. If all he right. didn't, if he didn't have. The concept of who he was. Right, he we have, say that. We have not lost ourselves. That's an angel. between the two of us. Remember the blurry angel? Oh, you're right. Good eye, good eye. Only it's not so blurry. Who took that awful picture? Right? I mean, I'd assume that the angel itself just was blurry. Was moving? In real life, because of how terrible of a photo it was. Alright, is there anything else that we're missing for stuff to pick up here? I'd say go in front of it and pray. Okay. Sh or first shoot the bird. Really? We're low on ammo right now. Okay, don't shoot the bird. <laughs> Save it for the angel. 
Is this even an angel, though? It's a weeping angel. This looks like some kind of a marketplace. It looks deserted, oh, just like everywhere else. Face. We ought to keep moving. I'd buy that it's a fallen angel. <laughs> it's a creepier looking angel than most angels. Yeah. Beelzebub, perhaps. Perhaps. This is like a, a huge stockpile of stuff here. So is that like an altar then? There's like a pedestal that are both, they're both empty. Should we try and disarm this? No. You got Sit it. Sit on one pedestal. But yeah, pick what that up. We Sit get? on a pedestal. A med kit. Large syringe in this. Uh, we'll, we'll sit on the pedestal in a moment. Okay. Large syringe in this medical kit provides major health restoration with temporary side effects. There are a limited number of them, but they also increase health a little with each use. Okay. So it raises our maximum health, but with temporary side effects. What side effects? Don't worry about it. <laughs> we might turn into a zombie for a little bit and kill Joseph. <laughs> that might happen. Aww. I feel like it's perfect, right? There's two of us. Yeah. And we could sacrifice ourselves at the altar. The, the right hand, above. left hand. Yeah. We could be the angel and demon on the shoulders of this demon. Maybe we need to or find sacrificial lambs angel. instead. Perhaps. Maybe we need to break a whole ton of barrels it and crates. A, it is a marketplace. I appreciate this, that, you know, we get back get back our stores that we just expended, right? All right. What a nice, buzzing, bustling marketplace. Capitalism so clearly many, works. Yeah. Such great business being done here. Okay, Is there actually stuff in that pot? We can't break the stew. Yeah, we got some beans in here. Or maybe rocks. <laughs> they tried to cook rocks. Hmm. They're very it's, flat. There's, it's actually not a bowl. It's smell an illusion. Things. They might be nearby. That's just a solid surface with a pattern on it. Yes. It's, it's, it's actually a, a statue. <laughs> an ornamental statue. Um, he says, I think I smell those things. Firewood. They might be nearby. Does he just mean monsters in general? I would go with fallen angels. Hmm. Has he ever smelled a fallen angel before? Have you ever? No. Chicken. It smells like chicken. Oh. Well, good to know. But more evil? Like chicken, but I more I don't really evil? know, because I killed it and ate it. Because it smelled like chicken. <laughs> Man was the real monster. All right. Oh, yeah. look, there's duck. I think we've almost broken all the things. Ooh. Oh, Secret my. Passageway. I Is this where Leslie's hanging out? Maybe. <gasps> Does it seem a little harder to move lately? No. No, not at all. That's just you. Joseph, right? It's the concussion. Joseph, I it's the concussion. It is Joseph, yeah. It's just the concussion and the slow zombification. Alcohol. Is that a flask? Oh. Sweet. Father was a stern man. Proud, and I thought intelligent, but he was also pious, a believer. Somehow he always supported the church no matter what the newspaper said. He waved away the allegations as if they were infallible. I think I smelled the those wretched, things. the vermin, they might be nearby, the stern. All were taken in by that church. They were promised salvation and eternal life. But there's nothing they could promise that I couldn't take away. Huh? Doesn't seem like a good thing to do at all. Yeah, Sebastian. it seems like we're the villain. Yeah, it's, it sounds pretty villainous. The guy takes in people that have done wrong in their life. Yeah. Like, helps help them out. Them. Yeah. And then we do something. And we. I mean, I jump to the conclusion we kill him. It seems but that way, yeah. That's what I jumped we to as well. We could just corrupt them. Sure. Sure. We're just like a, te a tempter. So we are a detective, right? If yeah. there were no bad, what would we try to discover? Nothing. Yeah. We'd have nothing to 
we'd lose our job. Yeah, we would. We need those people to be bad. We'd be out of a job if there was no evil in the world. So I've we're, just justified it. We're gonna make some evil. <laughs> I don't think that's a good justification. That's but a justification. I don't know, like it's a, a thing that corrupt <laughs> stuff happens. We're looking out for our kid, right? We need the money because capitalism makes us do this. Right, we're looking forward to her arriving, and so we go down this dark path in order to make some money to support her. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is where we came from. Yeah. Uh, and and then it's a miscarriage, and that's that's what breaks us right there, is we, we had sacrificed all of our principles for this, this daughter. If it's not all in our mind, and the detective is real, and the, our partner's real, what could be happening? Oh, what's like an <laughs> like an alternative? Because I because right. there's, it's possible. It's not all in our mind. Other than just insanity, what could explain the things happening in this game? Yeah, and who we are. All right, so we've got a we've got your usual zombie virus. <laughs> yeah. Right. Right. So we're in a post-apocalyptic zombie world. What do you suppose we are? More like when. This architecture seems straight out of the Middle Ages. As yeah, we all know, electricity decay after elevators. Years. This place can't be real. It's like jumbled up memories. Which is strengthening the it's all in our head mind, but we're trying to get away from that game, okay? Because what's in our head is, is somewhat real. Well, certainly and there's a connection to reality. Like, reality is in our head. Right. Yeah. The only way that we experience reality is through our brain. And there's some sort of connection to, like, the objective reality that others experience. Sure. <coughs> Wait. We're doing this now, Joseph? Shit. Let's hide out in here for a minute. We could have gone through a patch of space. You know, the sun and the earth. Could, our solar system could move through a patch of space where magic is real. That's what happens in the Shadowrun universe. Is this what it was like, Seb? After the accident? Well, I never put a gun to my head. No, of course not. Just quietly sank into a bottle. Oh. We can't all be perfect. Going for the it deep never cuts. affected my work. But hey. You read the IA report. You know I didn't report you because I was worried about your work, Sebastian. <sighs> what else is there? We don't have time for this. I need my partner here. I'm counting on you. Well, that didn't sound like a man with a family, right? No. What else is there? Is it... So we Find are something? evil. Maybe. It's all symbols. Some kind of cult. Could be useful. The thing with I the think church. I'm okay. We should probably get going. Sound oh, sounded pretty evil. Huh. Got a pop a ringe. Mm. You know, we, it, it was just, you know, Joseph was spe speaking a lot of truth to us. It was a lot to deal with. So we had to resort to, to drugs, you know. Take the edge well, off. Well, so we throw bottles, right? To distract the bad guys. Uh huh. The bad guys. Right. That's like, like shooing away at problems with alcohol. Can we open up this? And we have an alcohol problem. Yeah. Concerned. Concerned? You think that we might be in a bad spot mentally? Well, so I think that it's from, like, it's all of this is from the lens of him, right? So they turn into these monstrous creatures, like, ooh, it's the evil within, right? Right. But I think that's because we are messed up. And that's our evil within showing normal people as bad people that we kill because they're evil. But they're not, we're just messed up in the head. 
It's where, like, a super corrupt detective that's, like... I don't know, it, like, just messed up. I, It's too early for me to just say he's corrupt. Right, <laughs> right. I want, what is, I'm curious what these map fragments are. Are these just, like, little con consumables, or not consumables, collectibles that are found in each area in the game? Is it going to actually show the way to something? I just kind of assumed it was a collectible, but... Yeah, I think that's the most likely thing. About so, this one, which, 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 which one should we open? What do you want? I really don't even care. Door number one? <laughs> yes, that sounds good. Okay. Because I'm mostly consumed with our partner being normal, but also somewhat turning. And then we always talk him back. Yeah. Um, he wanted to kill himself. He started, he was realizing some of the things that he did because he was like in a mind mesh with us and in our evilness. Maybe not. Oh, right. Right. Because there is this whole, like, synchronization thing mm -hmm. of, like, mental experiments it's, going on. I really love this right now. <laughs> yeah. Man. And so he's starting to turn because he's straying from us. And then we, like, grab him and pull him back. Right. We're like, if you go, if you go being a good guy and trying to... A good guy, which is evil to him with right. his messed up brain right then we're going to have to kill you yes and we don't want to have to kill him because he's our partner so come back to us right man makes sense we are messed up Wait, we're pretty messed up yeah I, I think that no matter what interpretation you take we're pretty messed up we have like a ton of brain goo how did we get this way? Okay, what should we spend it on? Um, I still like health syringe recovery, but there's also, I mean, sprint time seems less useful now than it was at the start of the game by a huge amount. Yeah. Like we don't run from our problems anymore. No, you know, we face right, them we, head on. We've gotten training from our psychologists. <laughs> <laughs> so many theories, Tom, so many theories. I don't really, yeah, what? I thought I felt like we were doing fine, so I don't even feel the need that we need to upgrade. So you can pick whatever. Ooh, all right. Do the bolts probably. Bolts, harpoon bolts, harpoon bolts are common. Okay. We. Or maybe oh, the pistol. Actually, the pistol has been kind of weak. Actually, let's upgrade the number of agony bolts. This seems outrageously totally overpowered. Totally good idea. <laughs> this is outrageously overpowered because uh, it's like you get plus one, but it's actually like plus five because oh, it's one for each type of it's agony cheap, bolt. Too. Actually, seems we really We could do good. it again. I'm down with that. Let's do it. Cool. Mm. Let's do some. You know what? I'm, I'm, I want some flaming harpoon bolts. That makes sense to me. Yeah. It, it turns out it gets way more expensive. Yeah, it does. But it'll be worth it once we get there. Do we spend the remaining or do we save? Let's save. Okay. Yeah. Good choice. Man. We're consumed by our work, but I thought we loved our daughter. Yeah. Was my joke actually reality? Like, he wrote it down and then just is like, well, that covers that. No, I I, I think the daughter's going to be a miscarriage. Why do you think that? Other than, like, it's a, it seems very, very plausible. Yeah, but I mean... Okay, okay. I didn't know if you, like, saw something. Well, I mean, sp specifically because of the juxtaposition of us saying, oh, we love you already. We can't wait for you to come into this world, followed by us saying, We're what else is there other than work? We become a drunk, and then we devote ourselves only to work. Yeah. Yeah. So what caused that break, right? <laughs> was the four light or four-armed woman really our wife? And she was oh. trying, we were like in marriage counseling. Oh, maybe it's not Rubik's wife. Maybe it's our wife. And then we shot her and killed her, burned her alive. Indeed. More rampant speculation. <laughs> she was trying to keep us from our work, man. <laughs> More rampant speculation next time on The Evil Within. Thanks for joining us.